when they killed the elephant, they had to chop off the whole face. From here to here was all tissue connected to this. So the poacher doesn't want to carry that out with all that tissue, so he sticks it in the fire. And this part doesn't burn because it's got tissue on it. And when it's bubbly, they scrape it off. The illegal wildlife trade is worth $20 billion a year. And the ivory is probably $4 billion of that. It's well-funded and well-organized. And that's why we call them transnational organized criminals. Many years ago, um, I developed ways to get DNA from the feces of elephants. Africa is so large, we were able to get rangers working for the country to sample the elephant dung from each of the protected areas and we've created a DNA map that shows the distribution of elephants across the whole continent based on their DNA. And then we get the same DNA from the tusks and we match the DNA in the tusks to the map. And we can get it anywhere in Africa to within 300 kilometers. It costs about $110 to do a DNA analysis on one tusk. We developed a way to representatively subsample these seizures. The two tusks from the same animal get separated. What we don't want to do is to analyze the same individual twice. So the first thing that we go through is to find the pairs so we can take one tusk of the pair out and only analyze one of it. 